Hey guys, I'm Jacob. You're watching the Preppers Bunker Outdoors. I want to do a quick review on the Hardcore Hardware or Hardcore Hammers. Did I say Hardcore Hardware? Hardcore Hammers or Hardcore Hatchets. Supernaturalist. Um, this one's a bit old. I've been reviewing it and using it for quite some time and I wanted to give you my thoughts on it. I've been using it a bit today, comparing it to some premium axes. I was going to say other premium axes, but this is not, in fact, in my opinion, a premium axe. We've got some issues here, and I'm just going to bang through them quickly. Um, the axe already comes from the factory looking worn out. They say that they do that because it works better. In my experience, it does not work better. It doesn't bite as early, and it doesn't bite as deep as it would otherwise. As far as the handle and handle quality, we have directly horizontal grain. Maybe you'll be able to see that here. And normally between that grain and this run out and this run out, that would be a problem. However, in this case, I don't think it will be a problem because of the thickness of this handle. They make the handle so thick that the quality of the wood that they use and the orientation of the grain simply doesn't matter. The problem is, that makes it absolutely terrible to use. Between that and the sticky urethane coating, which they, instead of fixing, they know people are complaining about it, instead of fixing it, they brag about it. Um, guys, this urethane coating is on here to make it cheap so that they can store 10 billion handles in a storage room without them rotting, mildewing, or whatever. Uh, makes them consistent and makes them cheap. So. Uh, We've got uh, the top cut off flush here. You know, a premium axe is going to have a bit of uh, the handle sticking through. It makes a stronger bond. Um, so I think that they have a good steel. As far as I can tell, it holds an edge acceptably. There's a lot of things that I like about this axe. But if uh, hardcore, hardcore Hatchets continues to make axes and hatchets of this quality, at this time there is no way for the price that I could recommend them to anybody. This hatchet with a mask is about $120, and for less money there are better options available. I am not doing this video because I wish them ill. Uh, they're American-made product, and I only wish them the best. In fact, I hope in watching this video, they will decide to, instead of bragging about their urethane handle, uh, which I'm telling you, it's going to fatigue your hand. I've got calluses. I work with axes. I'm sweating my butt off because I've been banging with this thing. I'm telling you, there's no freaking reason for it except for them to save you money to save themselves money they're not saving you money they're still selling this for 120 dollars a premium council tool uh hudson bay belt axe is 115 they're not saving you money they're saving themselves money and instead just hyping their product harder so if they change a couple of things, that uh, the geometry on their edge and a thinner, thinner handle, they could even still urethane it because you can strip urethane easy enough. A thinner handle with good grain, I would recommend this in a heartbeat. As it is, I think it works better as a hammer than it does as a hatchet. I have used it as a hammer and I did like it uh, to be used as a hammer. But there are other options on the market. If this... If this was all we had, we'd make it work. I'd put a new handle on it. Probably be fine, but it's not all we have. Thank the Lord, we have a market filled with options, many of which, in my opinion, not, it's not my opinion, guys, many of which are far superior to this supernaturalist. So that's my review. Um, I've had this axe for like two years, used it a good bit, and I've been waiting a long time to do this video simply because I was not looking forward to it. It's not a fun video to do. So, thank you for watching. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Below this video, you can see my apparel line off of Teespring. You can order it directly from them. They'll ship it directly to you. And in the description box below, you can see how you can support this channel. Um, whew, this is going to be a fun one. Thank you.